moisture and pH test begins with opening the concrete by diamond grinding. Basically this amounts to grinding the surface to remove any surface materials that would be blocking the test from getting an accurate reading from the slab. To mark out the areas that will be tested, some tape has been placed. Being used will be a moisture content meter and a pH pencil kit. The surface that will be tested for pH is first dampened, ideally with distilled water, but bottled water will work for the sake of the test. The pH pencil is a simple device. It's basically an element inside the, the pencil or the pen that when drug across the surface will give an indication of the surface pH. As the pencil is drug across the surface, the color goes quickly from a yellow to a dark blue. The dark blue indicates a high pH, somewhere in the range of maybe 11, 12, maybe even 13. The moisture content test is done simply by turning the meter on, allowing it to climatize or get the ambient temperature and humidity through the sensor, and then pushing the meter down so the pins are fully compressed to get the top three quarter inch reading of the moisture content or relative humidity of the concrete surface. This will vary by times of the year. This particular slab in the summer is over 3%. This time of the year in the spring is less than 3%. And that's pretty much it. Gives an idea of the pH of the surface of the concrete when fully saturated with water. And the moisture content is tested in a dry state to say what its current condition is.